Welcome to my crib. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, then welcome. And my name's Crystal. I just wanted to show you guys around my apartment and do like an apartment tour video where I show you certain pieces of decoration and where I got it and how much it costs. And I'm also going to be linking all of the pieces of decor that is still for sale online in the description box down below. So yeah, if you guys enjoy this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel and let me know if you have any questions about little pieces that you see around the house that I didn't mention. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So I got all of these pillows from Home Goods, including this like little cylinder pillow. This is my favorite pillow, so that's why it's so dirty because I get makeup all over it every night when I sleep. Um, and I got this one from Home Goods. And I got these fluffy gray pillows from Home Goods as well. And the pillow shams here are from Walmart. I got these little picture frames from Ross as soon as they opened back up after being closed. So they were on sale, I believe, for about $11 a piece. And I got a set of three, and they match my bed frame perfectly. I also have the matching dresser to the bed frame, which is also from Aaron's. This is my vanity that I kind of created myself. So the mirror is actually from Amazon and it was $129 and it has a USB port on the side for charging. I also really like this mirror because it has these controls and you can just touch it on and touch it off and you can also change the tone and the brightness of each tone so if you want the this tone to stay at this brightness it will completely like stay that way until you change it and then if you hold down on the P it will brighten it and the mirror will keep that setting until you change it so on top of my dresser I have my TV and this vase that I got from Dee Dee's discounts Inside the vase there is these little grass things and they are at Hobby Lobby right now and they are 50% off. So they were $19.99 and then with the 50% off they were only 10 bucks. I used to have nothing on this wall but it looked a little boring. I felt like my room had like no decor at all. So I went to World Market today and also Hobby Lobby and I got this wall hanging from World Market. And I believe it was only about $24. And I got this cow skull from Hobby Lobby. And it was on sale for $25. It's originally $50. But all of their wall decor is 50% off right now. And then both of these little sayings, wall decor thingies were on sale as well for 50% off. This little wood wall hanging is also from Hobby Lobby on sale and I got it to add to this wall so I could have a cute little wall full of cute little decor and stuff. <laughs> on the other side of my dresser I have this glass vase that I bought from Hobby Lobby today and it was only $3.99 and I snipped these fake eucalyptus leaves off of a bigger eucalyptus plant that I got from Walmart and I'll show you that once I get to the bathroom so I'm sure most of you know as soon as Ross opened back up they had a huge sale so I wanted to go ahead and show you what I got so this mirror is from Ross and it was only $20 so I got this fake plant from Ross and it was also on sale it was about $12.99 and I have it sitting on top of this table from Ross and it was only $20. I think this table is really cute. It could be used as like a plant stand or a side table for your bedroom or anything like that. I think they did have a few left whenever I went last time too. Moving on to this little corner of my room. I hung these curtains up because I did not have a window for these curtains and I just thought they would be really cute to put as the entrance to my room. I just used thumbtacks and made little 
ruffles in the curtains so it looks like they were hung up. I got this wall hanging from Hobby Lobby a couple years ago, so I don't know if they still carry it or not, but I'm sure that they have similar ones, if not the same one. And right below, I have this little sign that says inhale, exhale, that I got from five and below. So just behind the curtains on this wall beside my door, I hung my hats up because that seems to be an up and coming trend. And I have in this corner a little tree slash plant not really sure what it's called but i got it from walmart and i think it was like 12 dollars. i actually have the label on it so it's actually a yucca cane this is the eucalyptus plant that i was telling you about earlier that i got from walmart and i snipped pieces off of it to put in that other vase but i really like the way it looks in here on this wall over here i have these little pictures that i got from target i have them stacked up oh my god are you okay? Over here I have the essential oils that I got from Target around Christmas time last year. He's in all of my clips because he's everywhere. Moving on to other parts of the house. This is the little kitchen that comes in my little apartment. It's very small so I mean there's not a lot of room to cook but it gets the job done. I really like the countertops and the backsplash in here. I got this Black & Decker coffee pot from Target. It's really small, but it's perfect for just me. And then I got the little sugar container from Target as well. One of my favorite things that I bought for the kitchen is this little drying rack. And this is actually from Sheen, and it was less than $5. I literally love using products from Myers, and I always order online from Grove Collaborative. I just feel like I save so many trips going to the grocery store by just ordering my cleaning products online. So I got this hand soap, and it is the rain scent. And I'm telling you guys, this stuff smells so amazing. And I got this little wooden thing, and you put like dish soap in it, and you just like pump it. It's really good for getting the food off the dishes before you put them in the dishwasher. And I also got this little spray bottle that I put Thieves, like essential oil cleaner in, and this hand sanitizer from Grove, and I also have the dish soap. And the tray is also from Grove. Right above this sink, I have this little saying that I got from Hobby Lobby. It says, little house, lots of love. I really like that because my apartment is tiny, but it's perfect for me. And I love my little snake plant. I've had her for about a year. And I have her potted in a little stand and pot that I got from Walmart. And I think this is like super cute, especially for the price. I believe it was less than $15. And then I have a little LG smart TV that I keep in the kitchen in case I want to watch like recipes or something while I cook. This mason jar vase is from Dollar General actually and it was about $5 and then I have these bunny tails that I got off of Etsy and I'm not sure the exact person that I bought it from because there's so many on Etsy but if you just search like dried bunny tails you should be able to find some. I have Tuck's little food and water bowls that I got from Marshall's. They um, were actually gifted to me by my friend Jason. If you're watching this, hey Jason. Also, they were $12.99 a piece at Marshall's. In the corner, I have a mirror from Walmart that I got a couple years ago. It was on sale at the time. It was about $40, but I haven't been able to find it ever since at that price. But I think they do sell this mirror still at Walmart. Um, and I also have this wall hanging on the wall over here. This is from Five and Below, and it was obviously only $5, which is really good because it's super cute, and I really like how well made it is, especially for the price. And that's just basically hanging above my little table here. I got this table from Marshalls a couple years ago, and the lamp on top of it is from Target, as well as the wax warmer from Walmart. The last room in the house that we haven't went over yet is my living room 
and I have this huge couch that I got from Aaron's a couple years ago. It was on clearance because somebody had leased it before and returned it and it's super huge so when I have guests over it's perfect. Everyone can just like pile up on the couch, watch movies and sleep and Tuck literally loves these pillows. All he does is lay on them all the time. Isn't that right Tuck? Right above the couch, I have this little piece of art that I got from Target. I believe they still sell it at Target. I think it was about $50. And my dad got me this lamp from Target as a housewarming gift. I really like these little curved lamps because they give your house such a like modernized feel. And this lamp was about $79. The mirror on the wall was a gift to me from my friend Jack, so I really am not sure where it's from. And I decided today to give my living room a little makeover because it was looking a little plain. So I just wanted to show you what it looks like as a whole and then I'll go over each thing individually. This little Sherpa blanket is from Walmart. It was only $8. I got it around Christmas time last year. So they'll probably come back out with them this year if they don't have them right now. I got this little um, knit woven blanket from Target and the tray is from Ross. So I went to World Market and I know that these lights are typically used to like put outside but I really like the look and the feel that it gives my living room so I bought some lights like this so I could hang them up and I wanted to show you this clock that's on my wall. This is also from Walmart. It was really cheap. And I got this wall hanging from I think Marshalls. It was literally like four or five years ago though. So these dried Pempas grass pieces are from Etsy. They sell them um, on the little shops and they're really expensive. So if anything I would just suggest buying the fake ones from um, Hobby Lobby on sale like the ones that I showed you that are in my room because they're, I mean, they're just as cute and they're way cheaper. I got this vase from Hobby Lobby today and I don't remember how much it costs. $19.99. And it probably had a sale because normally Hobby Lobby has a sale and it's kind of hard to keep these little grass things standing up straight. Anyways, so I also went to the garden supply company today and I got this cute little air plant and this pot to put it in and yeah, I haven't named her yet so put in the comment section below what I should name her. And also I got this little saying to put on my fireplace. It says, it's a good day for a good day. And then I got this little tassel garland thing to hang above my fireplace as well. I kind of thought that it matched the vibe that I was going for. I got this little hand holding a heart from Ross a couple years ago so it might be a little bit harder to find now. And this Burberry candle was gifted to me by my best friend Amber last Christmas. I also have one more of the fake eucalyptus from Walmart and I have this little milk jug as a vase that I also got from Walmart. So both of these curtains and curtain rods are from Walmart, they're the really cheap ones. I honestly just needed to add some life to my apartment because I get super duper lonely sometimes. So these are my friends. So that's pretty much it. My apartment is really small so that's why there's not much to see but I did have a couple requests to do this video so I hope you enjoyed it and if you did then be sure to like and subscribe to my channel again thank you so much for being here and for watching and I hope you guys have a great day subscribe subscribe to my mommy